What's up YouTube? In today's video I wanted to show you some retro gaming on my massive 120 inch screen. I have a PS1 Classic Mini hooked up to my home theater setup using a 120 inch screen. My PS1 Classic is actually modded with a Bleem Sync running on it and I have uh, custom menus on it as you see here. I'm also using a fight stick. It's a Mayflash F500 fight stick with a custom artwork. It's a, a great experience checking out some of these old school games, the arcade games on a 120 inch screen. So uh, let's get started, let's check it out. So this is a retro arch. Uh, it's, it's running my custom dynamic wallpapers. I set all this up with wallpapers. What I did is I organized all my consoles to have uh, everything organized by system. So here you see my Atari collection. And then uh, I'm able to scroll up and down, go through all the different games and see all the different box art. Bunch of classics here, Donkey Kong, Frogger, Moon Patrol, Miss Pac-Man, Pitfall, Yars Revenge. And then to the right, I have uh, my MAME arcade collection. This, uh, this is a list of all my favorite arcade games. I, I pretty much play this all the time. I love playing arcade games. As you've seen in my other videos, uh, I have an arcade one up. I have a PS Vita loaded with arcade games. So yeah, I gotta, I gotta play my arcade games, guys. Love playing uh, old school retro games. So here's my list. Altered Beast, Bad Dudes. Let's uh, check out some of these games. Here's Bad Dudes. So um, I went ahead and added bezels to my arcade games. Man, these, are, these bezels are real nice. Uh, I used the bezel project program to add these bezels. They came out real nice. They look great on this uh, 120 inch screen. So I kept uh, the original aspect ratio of the video game, which most of them are, you know, four by three, since they use CRT and then the bezels. This is Bad Dudes. Uh, I remember playing this game at the arcade all the time. This game came out around the time when ninjas were real popular, all the ninja movies, American ninja movies. So the video game was just as popular as well. Let's go ahead and just uh, enter some quarters. All right, here we go. Just all these ninjas coming right at you, throwing sh uh, shining stars. Classic. All right, let's check out some more games. So I got uh, some of the other classics. Cadillacs and Dinosaurs, the original Contra, the arcade game, Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong has uh, great bezels as well. Check it out. This game actually looks huge on this screen. Um, so Donkey Kong, I'm keeping the original aspect ratio, which is vertical. It's a vertical setup. And then the bezels to the left and right, they just add to that, to the classic look. Like all this, the original artwork looks awesome. Let's get some Donkey Kong. Turn up the volume. 
volume. And if I remember correctly, I think this is the first time Mario appeared in a game. I want to say that's true. <laughs> yeah, awesome game. All right, let's check out some more games. Double Dragon, Final Fight. Final Fight is still my favorite beat em up game of all time. Check out those bezels. Love the bezels, guys. I usually go with Guy. I'm trying to play with one hand here. <laughs> Right, check out some more games. Just trying to do a quick uh, preview of everything. Frogger, Galaga, Go, uh, Ghosts and Ghosts, Ghosts and Goblins, Magician Lord, Marvel vs. Capcom. Let's check that one out. It's nice to play these games with a fight stick, you know, keep that same arcade experience. Um, definitely nice. And uh, the PS1 Classic Mini is, I would say, my favorite classic mini system from the recent mini systems that came out. Uh, it's just so many things you can do with it. Like, you're able to connect any controller you want. And then that's how I hooked up my fight stick, but you can connect PS4 controllers, Xbox controllers, just anything with a USB connection uh, should work. So I love the PS1 Classic just because of all its capabilities. You can play games. It runs all these games smooth. Like I have PS1 games on it, but I really don't even play the PS1 games. I just uh, play all these old school games on it. So here's a few more games. Let's see here. Metal Slug. Mortal Kombat, the original. Let's check that one out. Um, turn up the volume here put get some bass in here I still think Mortal Kombat 1 is still fun and it uh, definitely has held its, it's held its own. Very fun game still. Really all the first three Mortal Kombat's, they're all fun. All right, as uh, Sonya beats me up there, let's try another game. Mortal Kombat 3, Mortal Kombat 2, Miss Pac-Man, ooh, NBA Jam. Booting up. And these are all the arcade versions. So this one, um, 
this NBA Jam, the arcade version, has Shaq in it. I think the Super Nintendo version of it removed Shaq. But Shaq's in this one. Like it's a full game. I'll quickly show you. So there goes Charles Barkley. Then Shaq with Orlando. Skinny Shaq. <laughs> when he first joined the league. Skinny Shaq. But yeah, there he is. Alright, let's check out some more games. Pac-Man, I love the bezels on Pac-Man. Check it out. Look at that. I love them. Just uh, that old school classic look. Pac-Man was another vertical game, so it's nice to see bezels to fill up the screen. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's look at a couple of more. Let's go ahead and check out oh Shinobi. I love Shinobi. Street Fighter, the original Street Fighter is on here. All oh, these Street Fighter games. I love Street Fighter. Champion Edition is probably my favorite Street Fighter. So let's check it out. There it is. Check out those bezels. It looks just like the arcade. Awesome. There it is. Huge. Looks huge, guys. I don't know if you're able to see it in the video, but it looks huge. A lot of games on here, Sunset Riders, the Turtle games. Let's check out Turtles real quick. And there it is. This game is still fun. Lots of fun. So I actually have, I have two versions on here because one of them is the two player version and then the other one is a four player version. With two players, I'm able to select any turtle I want. And then the four player version, if I hook up, uh, you know, PS4 controllers or any other controllers, I'm able to play all four turtles, all four players. So that's another thing that's pretty cool about the PS1 Classic. You're able to play four-player games. All right, King of Fighters, Simpsons. Same thing with Simpsons. Two versions, two players, and four players. Um, the two-player version is so you have so you're able to pick any any character you want. That way, you're not stuck with Marge. You can pick Bart or Homer or Maggie. Ultimate Mortal Kombat Three. Vigilante. Ooh, Super Mario is the original. That's the original Super Mario World. It's the one that came out at the arcades. WrestleFest, WrestleMania, X-Men, again, two-player, four-player, and X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Uh, just real quick, take a look at some of my other systems. TurboGrafx-16, Blazing Lasers is my favorite, but there was other great ones. Bonk's Adventure, uh, it had... Uh, Raiden game, Shinobi, Splatterhouse, Vigilante, uh, Game Boy Advance, all the Mario games, bunch of Pokemon games, Nintendo 64. So it actually Nintendo 64 works really good on here on the on the PS1 Classic. Let's do some quick. I'll show you guys real quick. How about what's a good game to show you? 
Smash C and Super Smash Bros. Since we're using the fight stick, let's go with Super Smash Bros. There it is. Works good with the fight stick. I guess you can technically call this game a fighting game. quickly show you guys all right let's see here it takes a second to close okay so here's some more systems Nintendo all these are run great on here Mike Tyson's Punch-Out is kind of one of my favorites. Of course, all the Mario games. And then uh, Super Nintendo, love Super Nintendo, Donkey Kong Country, and um, all the different arcade ports, like Final Fight and all of those that were ports from the arcade. Mega Man's NBA Jams, PlayStation, um, it is a PS1 classic, so it has PlayStation games on here. And then Dreamcast. Dreamcast. Uh, at PS1 Classics, actually, I want to play some of these Dreamcast games. Let's see. Let's just try Marvel vs. Capcom 2. That seems to be the popular Dreamcast game. It's actually not going to work. Whoops, sorry guys. There's an error. Can't show you that game. Alright, moving on. Genesis. Genesis games and PSP. PSP runs great on here. It's uh, one of the surprising things about the PS1 Classics, able to play PSP games. Real quick, I'll show you a game. So Calibur, since I'm using a fight stick. There it is. Yeah, PSP games run good on here. And uh, the graphics look great. Even though these games are meant to be played on a, you know, a little small screen portable device, they look awesome on here. All right, let's get some quick gameplay real quick. Where is Kratos? There he is. Since we're using the PSP version, uh, let's use Kratos. So he was a uh, exclusive on the PSP version. <laughs> so Kratos in a Soul Calibur game. And <laughs> I haven't really ever used Kratos on here, so I have no idea what moves he does.
There he goes. All right, let's go ahead and close that. All right, guys, I uh, think I must wrap it up here. Have a PlayStation collection here with uh, Tekken 3. It's the game I kind of play the most from my PS Classic, I mean P PS1 collection. But all right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Thanks for watching. Um, hit that like button, subscribe. More videos coming soon. All right, guys, peace.